today we're going to be revisiting an older video to see what sold, what I made a profit on, and what I probably could have left on the shelf. We are here today at the Big Goodwill in Lancaster. We're meeting up with Dagny and we're gonna head in to see what we can find to buy and put for a profit. Here we go. This down here looks like Studio Nova. I actually looked this up the other day at the, um, the re recommendation of a viewer and this actually has, um, has potential. So I think I'm gonna grab this and put this in my cart uh, because the 80s are definitely making a comeback. All right also snatched this off the shelf. Um, five other people were walking down the aisle. It's Le Biscuit. Uh, it has a checkered design, blue and white. I don't see any damage on it. There is crazing. $3.99. So I'm really actually kind of surprised there's no damage on it. But, uh, that's maybe just a little bit of a glazing issue but we're gonna take that with us here's a spoon rest it's 2 dollars it looks like it could be a usa pottery spoon rest nice flower it's good for spring i know just in case you were wondering this is what it is snatch this off the shelf as dagny and i were zipping by to check out this monstrosity this giant bok choy good luck sculpture a red-eyed frog. It's a rare type of frog, in case you were wondering. Tucked in the back there, and I happened to notice it on its edge. I recognize the glaze as Francoma, and it is. Uh, I guess this is for mm, Oklahoma. It's the state bird. Tailed flycatcher. They have only $1.99 on that, and I don't see any chips or cracks. It's just a trivet. But... Definitely worth slowing down and checking the shelves because even though it's really busy today, there's still stuff. I had no idea, but it is. It's made in Mexico. That's really cool. I didn't realize that. I think there's another one on the shelf somewhere unless somebody grabbed it. Oh, free money. Yeah, dinosaur bank. I know. They're like, here, take this dinosaur with you. Okay. Cute little sea creatures. There's no pricing on them. Oh, Disney Pixar made in China. Isn't that from Dory? Yes. And down here is the other Mexico um, dinosaur. It says, what is it? Made in, uh, I can't pronounce that word and I've tried it before and butchered it. There's two dinosaurs. I think I'm going to get out of here now and I will get back to you in the car with the total. All right, well, I have moved on to the next Goodwill, but our total spend there was $48. Uh, we got some pretty decent stuff. I'm excited about those Mikasa plates. That's something I have always overlooked in the past, but after having recently seen comps, decided that, you know what, those might be worthwhile. So the dinner plates sell between $18 to $24 a piece, and then we got a few bowls and we got the mug, so I think we're good there. And, and the dinosaurs, the dinosaurs were amazing. <laughs> but we are here in effort and now I'm gonna head into this Goodwill and see what we can find. This is a smaller Goodwill. I usually only come away with a couple of things but um, it's worth stopping in and checking out and seeing what we can find to buy and flip for a profit. So here we go. A little bit of sitting sugar here. Check that out. Just hanging out for 99 I don't see... Oh yep it is marked on the back. Sitting sugar. And I don't see any chips or cracks around the edges. That is a great buy. I kind of like this lamp. It says it works. It appears to have been a canister that somebody converted into a lamp. Maybe it was always intended as a lamp. It's probably an art project piece. GC 2008. I kind of like the naivety of it though. $3.99. Yeah, it's in decent condition. It shouldn't be too hard to ship. Well, there are currently three employees buzzing around, putting stuff on the shelves. I'm going to head up towards the checkout and I will get back to you from the car. 
Okay, well our total spend there was $22 and the Sid and Stricker dish is gonna more than pay for everything we bought today. So everything else is just a bonus. We got some good stuff. I hit it at just the right time. There was three people running around putting stuff on the shelves and I spent a few times going up and down, but I think that uh, we got the good stuff. So I'm gonna get out of here now. I'm gonna head on to the next Goodwill, but you guys are gonna have to wait for that video and uh, I will see you tomorrow. So long. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day and I've posted a link to that down in the description. If you enjoyed this video, we will be posting videos just like this every Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, so make sure you stay tuned, make sure you hit the subscribe button, and I have included a link to the playlist down in the description.